It's all free. So literally, if a school has internet connectivity and has computers, any type of computer, they're ready to start at one plus one and, and, get, and get the calculus. It's great for motivation. It's great for practice. I wouldn't go back and teach another way if I had the choice. When I first um, heard about Khan Academy, the most appealing point of it was that it was going to reach all students where they are and to meet them where they are. When I heard that they can work at their own pace and that it would free me up to be able to work with individual groups of students, I just jumped on it. I always wanted to try to do other things. I always tried to pull in projects. I always tried to find ways of hitting all the students at all their levels. And I just never felt like I was doing a very good job at it. So when Khan Academy came, within the first two weeks, I just looked at it and said, oh my goodness, this is amazing. It finally gave me the freedom to know that I was teaching everybody and that nobody at any time was bored. Khan Academy has really had a great impact on most of my students. Uh, there are those high achievers who use it to move ahead and they're curious about math and they're wanting to move on and they're wanting to explore new things and they have the ability to do that. Then we have those struggling learners who are still struggling with basic math that they never mastered in third, fourth, or fifth grade. And this gives them a chance to go back and fill those gaps in their understanding and move forward on a firmer foundation. It, it really comes down to what's the benefit for the student, what's the benefit for the teacher, in that order. Khan Academy got students the instruction, the learning that they needed at the level they were at, at the time they needed it. Using the data, um, I can break students into groups. Um, I can target students who are specifically um, struggling in certain areas. I can also see students um, as a whole, like if, for instance, the class completes a module um, on like least common multiple and they've all mastered it before I introduce it in the class, then I know, hey, this isn't something I need to spend as much time on. So as a teacher, it's freed up learning time for me to use time more efficiently. It's changed my students um, because they're more accountable and they know where they're at. They definitely have a sense of whether they know something or they don't. They are much more vocal and they advocate for themselves and it's changed me because I know a lot more about my students. One thing Khan has changed dramatically is now they're learning processes. They're learning how to do them correctly as opposed to just learning how to get by. The students kind of see it as a video game where in a video game you fail all the time. And what we've noticed has been great is that students learn from their mistakes before it's too late and they grow and they learn the math instead of um, continuing to pretend they understand it. It helps in that I can pinpoint certain areas. Sometimes you can go for weeks and not know that a kid didn't get something from two chapters ago. So with Khan Academy, those things kind of show up more often and you can, you can go in and sort of save the day. <laughs>